and Joe, boys and girls, back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time we finished Micah's chain of missions. Well, let's see what Dutch needs, is the real question. Actually, it looks like there's a couple missions we can choose from. But. Say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you. Okay, Pierce will do your stuff. I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. You come near me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you're gonna be missing a hand. Lee. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> Enough, both of you! <laughs> well, come with me, then. You wanna head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Oh! Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah. Sure. Here's my list, and... Can you post this letter for me? While you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. All right. Are you coming with me then, woman? Okay, I'm all with this. this is cool. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. God. Yeah. Go to the store. I have a feeling we're gonna go hunting or something. You cool down then yet? I guess. I ain't no scullion, and I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating halfwit. I guess we all gotta do our share, princess. <laughs> Where's that letter? Are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. There. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> uh. He ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All mail to be sent to the same alias. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Okay, here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you- No! Are you insane? Well, I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there Bank of road. and buy mm. some food to eat. No guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. Post office? If she's gonna go shopping, we're gonna go to the post office. Okay. I mean, technically, we're doing more women's work in this century. Hi 
How do you do, sir? Hi, Clark. Can I help you, mister? Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. So that's how you do it, send the, the fish and stuff that we're gonna do eventually. That's helpful. Hmm. I burnt folds with more strength than you. Help! My sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out bright blue. I'm trying. Try harder. Uh. I think this is everything. Thanks. Here, take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady. Get a move on. I like Sadie. Not lady. I know. Yeah. Mm. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Uh. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and know nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Hey there! Hey. Huh? What, uh... What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lamorne Raider country. Keep it cool. You lady. need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Go! Go, go, go! Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Go! I mean, yeah. This chick. No, pass those reins here. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Careful now. Yeah. We show those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. You did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks. But maybe not. So who do they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Anyway, don't you go ribbon piercing about that letter. How dare you? 
I can't just steer it, it's good as what it's good as thing. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we uh Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping. Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe, <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> oh, we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice man, by the way. That was fun. Um... Camera? Awesome. Camera's acting funky. There it goes. That's stuck on something it looks like. Well, let's go see what Dutch wants. Well, hold on, can we go to Hunger Charles? Awesome. What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. <laughs> no, you simple minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. From which you can get anything. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Do it. We need to study bison anyway. Look what what I'm thinking about it. So on the Oh wait. You know, it was before my time, of course, but my mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. Where the bison went, my people went. And they were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood, but I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. It's actually a uh, random fact. Native Americans so, actually have like, the highest rate of alcoholism in the amongst the most populations. Okay. Feels like there's been so much noise and chaos recently. Would you mind if we just rode and enjoyed the silence for once? I need to clear my mind. Sure, fine by me. Can we just teleport there then? I mean, that'd be nice. Rabbit. Dang it. I'm not ready to bite rabbits. We are rabbit. Someone coming this way? Oh, I'm still one in here. That sucks.
It really wants me to aim at Charles for some reason. Ah, <laughs> uh, rabbits. Not looking for company or company. I'm not here for you. Unless you want me to be here for you. Oh god, we're getting close to Valentine again. Not far now. Let's cut up this way. I don't know why animals are like that. I don't care about Charles. I did, I'll let you know. Over there. You see them all? Incredible, aren't they? We should one of them. I'll keep them ringed in and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Wait, did I lose my, uh... Oh, my car right there. Okay. So, my question is, I know it's, uh, Animal Compendrium. You can look at the American Bison, and I'll tell you everything you need. We need to track and kill one. Oh, oh, that was the other thing. That was the other thing I wanted to show you. Crap. I thought the last second. Also, it tells you the best way to get the best power. Which would be, um... I've heard what is a cranial rifle or both improved arrows. So we do have a rolling black, black rifle. I don't know if it's going to be strong enough. We're going to find out. Yeah. Yeah. ML's here, apparently. It's not that I had to use two shots, but... Okay, that one, uh... Dang. Good job. Four. Stop on your horse and mount up. I wanna go check something out. Okay, let's go. All right, boy. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what attracted them. So, oh, vultures? Okay. A little random. Oh, that's how you dual wield. You pick both of them. someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. I say we follow him. Alright. Lead the way. Why can't I not run? Okay, got it. Always good to see. Could it have been an animal? 
No, they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. I'll show you where we're going. Look, another dead bison to our left there. Come on. Oh, that's getting frustrating. Even I like bison. Shot and left for dead again. But this one looks fresher. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. Green tobacco I can always use. And it's a lot of chewing back. Those fish bones I see. Hogs haven't gone cold yet. Uh, Maybe half a day since they left. Bison's been dead about the same. Wild time. carrot. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. I mean, I need vegetables anyway. I need all the flowers I can. I know. I my cords are low. I mean, my health cords are low. Boy. Where are we going? This way. We should have a good view from up here. Oh, well, that would be a short mission to go with the other okay. mission, but, uh... You see anything? Look, smoke to the north. Could be another camp. Let's go check it out. Another camp? Okay. Bastards. Just killing for fun. You think we can talk? I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Good point. That's the way it should be. Charles mad. Don't make Charles mad. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? <laughs> Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. Ah! Ah! It's that business of mine! Oh God, you're crazy! I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. What the hell are you doing? Why are you killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it what? look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No, please don't kill me. I'm begging you. I've heard enough. Damn right. That's what he deserved. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm going to see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. What the heck? I actually do a hated Indian at this time, but... My hat back, yay! Poison <gasps> throwing that thing up?
Not for that, guys. Thanks, someone. Red Dead Redemption 2. Dude, I actually touched the dodge. See you there.